Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have this makeup look for you. It's just like quite a glowy, kind of silver, glitter, smoky eye, we'll call it. <laughs> um, yes, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy. If you want to see more kind of makeup looks, then let me know. And give a big thumbs up if you do enjoy. Let's jump right into the video. So I'm just using tape and I'm just using it so that I get a really sharp line on the outer corner of my eye. It also helps when you're doing eyeliner as well. I'm then using my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer and NW15 just to prime my eyes and then I'm blending it out with Mario Techniques Medical Complex and Sponge. I'm then using my Modern Renaissance Palette by Anastasia Beverly Hills. I'm then buffing Golden Ochre in the crease with a Real Techniques Base Shadow Brush and this will just be my transition shades. I'm then taking a clean blending brush just to like blend out the edges so there's no harsh lines and then I'm taking raw sienna and then I'm just deepening that crease. And then I'm just using the fluffy side of an Anastasia brush that comes with the Modern Renaissance palette and then I'm just taking a medium brown and the 25A Morphe palette just to deepen out my outer V and it just gives a little bit more definition. And then I'm just going in with my Real Techniques brush again with the Raw Sienna shade and this is just to blend everything out again. So I'll go back and forward and do this step a few times just to get some pigmentation there. And then keep going back in with the same blending brush, the one with no product on it, just to blend out all the edges and make sure everything is nice and blended. I'm then using the Stella A Liquid Eyeshadow in Smoldering Satin and I'm just using that in the inner corner to the middle of my lid and then I'm going in with the Barry M Glitter Rush in Snow Globe and I'm just layering that on top just to get extra extra glitter. I'm then using my NYX a Matte Liquid Liner and then I'm just doing a wing. It's pretty easy with the tape, you just kind of follow along and then just um, and use that as a guide. I then cut these uh, eBay lashes in half, use them from my outer corner and use my dual glue and then I just did my bottom eye shadow, just kind of mimicking the top, just smoking it out. I'm then using my Nivea Men's Post Shave Balm for primer and this really sticks the makeup on and then I'm going in with my Maybelline Baby Skin. This is really good for um, your pores. Then I'm using my True Match Foundation and then I'm just blending it in with a Real Techniques sponge. For my concealer I'm using the same concealer as earlier, the MAC uh, Pro Longwear in NW15 and just using the sponge again just to give me some highlight. And then I'm setting all over my face with my RCME No Colour Powder. I'm then using my NYX blush in top, or top however you say it, and this is just a contour, it's like a really good contour shade if you're pale like me. Then blending that out and then using my favourite bronzer which is the e.l.f. bronzer in Bronze Beauty and just using that to bronze everywhere. I'm then using my sugar blush from Makeup Revolution to give me a bit of colour on the cheeks. And then I'm going in with my Mary Luminizer, a highlighter by the Bam, everywhere on my face so I'm getting nice and glowy. And then I'm going in with eyebrows. I'm using my e.l.f. angled brush and my freedom pomades in Auburn and just filling in my eyebrows. I'm then just using raw sienna just to smoke out my lower lash line again. Then use a bit of um, mascara and then I'm just doing my lips using Spice by MAC and then my Retro Matte Lip in Burnt Spice. These two pair really well together. I'm then going to set my face with the Makeup Revolution Pro Fixing Spray and that's us done. Here's the finished look guys, I really hope you enjoyed it. If you want to see more kind of makeup looks, then let me know. So if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe so you don't miss any more of my videos. Thanks guys!